my friends. Hello. So the short of it is, we've been in here every single day for the last three months. Except for the weekends. Nice. Trying not to Burning suck. the midnight oil. Trying not to suck. I like it. Can we jump in if I, if the I first look out? The people first get look into the album? be like... <laughs> the so. first look we want is to take people and say they're pushing it with the melodies they're pushing it with the songwriting they're pushing it with the length of the song pushing it with technicality which we didn't even know they could do my favorite version of it it's like oh that's like some of the best performance on the record a couple days where we were talking you know through yeah, those of kind of that idea be true to who we are and make the music we feel like making with no fucking shame and just closing our eyes and yeah, exactly. punching people in the fucking face. Exactly. <laughs> you know what I mean? So nothing since our early discussion has changed course. <clears throat> We've just developed some of these things. Refined it. Refined, we're yes. still refining these refining. things. Refining. It's in the barrel. It needs, to, it, needs to, um, it needs to age. It's almost like you're putting together like a meal. Like we talked about, like use a food analogy. It's like, okay, I'm gonna, the first thing I'm going to put in front of you is going to shock you. And the second thing I'm going to put in front of you is going to be just delicious. That's exactly what right? you wanted. Feed you, send you off, like, this was the experience. That's really where a lot of those, those like, experimentation and themes and the story of the record is going to play out musically and, and lyrically. Mm -hmm. And there, like, I kind of want a little taste of A Thousand Suns in it. And the idea of, like, it's got a narrative, it's got a bit of a concept and themes may show up and then show up again a different way and like yeah. stuff to tie it in because if Duck you, three ways. If you start <laughs> if you start to think about it in the context of like there was like thrash metal on this record as Rob was saying and there's these beautiful melodic parts and there's these prog rock parts and all this like great rock music but it's in the context of like something that's clearly complex and very like colorful, very three-dimensional. It, it takes a certain level of like finesse to like even put it together. That's going to be a really rewarding experience.